In this particular session, we're going to talk about the AMS333 self-latching monitoring box. This is a, your personal design. It's patented here in Australia. Talk us through it. The 333 um, is designed in particular to um, encompass issues with dual lock levers handles. Um, and it's a, it's a situation where we have a problem in high security applications where they need two locks on a security door. Okay, one of the problems that we found, and my, and my background is a locksmith, so um, we used to fit a lot of these security locks to high security applications around Australia. Um, and one of the issues is when you have two locks on a door, as here, which is a security requirement, when the top lock is actually, if the top lock was actually locked, the door wouldn't close. And when you've got a situation where you've got a security door and a fire door, there becomes a clash of these specifications. The security says you must have two locks on the door for high-end security applications yeah. we're talking here. But the fire regulations say you can't put a square bolt deadlock on a fire door. So basically what we've designed here is a, is a product. It's an actually an automatic self-latching micro switch box. So it's actually a dual function situation. What actually happens is it will take the door with the lock in the thrown position, but it will also monitor that bolt when the door closes. And this is specifically for a SCEC endorsed uh, building, or that has to meet a SCEC endorsement, yep. but for a fire door to meet the security requirements of that SCEC specification. Pre predominantly it was designed for a fire door yep. to meet the fire regulations, but it, it, it's, it's more than that. Okay, it's a more, it's a bigger product than that. In as much as that, any security door that you've got an issue where somebody could inadvertently or deliberately latch the top lock out or throw the top bolt of the top lock out, so the door won't close, it's going to be a security breach. Yeah. So basically, what we've got here is a situation where you've got somebody who's latched the lock out for deliberate reasons, for whatever that might be. Or alternatively, you've got somebody that inadvertently throws that top lock, which actually means if it is a fire door or a security door, when the door closes, it won't latch. The, the actual square bolt would hit, normally would hit on the door frame and it would hold the door open. Yeah. So number one, for fire, obviously fire can go through the door because it's not locked properly, it's not secured, and obviously for security, it's not secured if the doors are closed. So the trick here is really a bit of a this is your latch Correct. here. So basically what happens here is when I close the door, the latch itself actually retracts. So it's a reversal of a normal type of lock. Yeah. Okay? Whereas a normal type of lock, the latch actually retracts. In this situation, the actual micro switch box latch retracts. So because the square bolt deadlock won't retract in itself, we have to make this retractable. So basically what happens is when the door closes, the square bolt latch hits the the, the uh, latch here, the striker here, they both go in and then the outside pops out, which actually locks the door. Okay, that will actually the hold dead, the door with a dead bolt, with a dead bolt, bolt yep. correct? But actually holding the inside uh, plunger in, which actually gives it its secure value. So the security actually in this area here is actually monitoring that the bolt of the lock is actually thrown. And the other key aspect is that is also alarm. So, correct. Uh, so alarm that it, Exactly, it's actually alarmed. So basically what happens is if, if this, this actually pulses back to a central security station, which will tell you the door is locked, the door is locked, the door is locked, and of course as soon as somebody unlocks it, yep. it goes to the opposite, the door is unlocked. So it sends an alarm back, um, that's actually done through the security system itself, but this product enables it to work that way. But the real key to this product is literally the way the door closes. So in this situation we've got two locks on the door, the top lock is actually thrown, but when I close the door, they both lock. Now that door is actually locked and dead bolted, okay? Yeah. So now, with that top lock, it's actually, in, in real life terms, the lock bolt is actually being monitored as we speak, and it's sending a signal back saying, yes, the door is locked. In case of somebody wanting to actually open the door, of course, they can just literally push the handle down on the inside, say that. That would and I'll show you that. On the other side. I'll show, you, I'll show you how this works as well. So that's really one part of, of the product. That product, which is called the AMS 6233, uh, it's an automatic micro switch box. Um, that's only one side of, the, the, of what we're actually discussing here today.